We need to check our pinpoint weather and traffic together. We're expecting some light snow to start moving in, what, in about an hour or so, TJ? I think within the next hour or so. We've actually seen some flurries across parts of the area, but they're real accumulating snow, probably another hour away. Let's take a look at what's going on right now in the live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar. Two areas of snow we're tracking, one out across southeastern Massachusetts and actually over here in southeastern Rhode Island. You can see it right in here, uh, riding in on some southwesterly winds winds, kind of uh, ocean effect snow, the cold air blowing over that relatively warmer water. Second batch of snow is out here across Connecticut. It's bumping into some dry air as it tries to work its way into Rhode Island, but for now uh, we're going to be dry. Eventually that layer of dry air moistens up and we'll be seeing the snow uh, reaching into southern New, uh, southern New England or southeastern New England, I should say. Temperatures in Smithfield, 21 degrees now, 22 in Gloucester, 24 in Coventry, mid 30s at the south coast. A southwesterly wind has brought in some milder air along the coastline of Rhode Island and even into Fall River now at 35 degrees. So you might get some snow, but it likely won't be sticking around all that much. If anything, though, the, the ground temperatures are extremely cold. So the snow that does fall, it'll melt and might actually uh, freeze on, uh, on contact, that melted snow. 24 degrees in Smithfield right now with a wind light about two miles an hour, 11 miles an hour worth of wind in Newport. Look at the temperature, 38 degrees. That's balmy compared to this time yesterday morning, about 38 degrees warmer. Satellite radar picture showing this big stripe of snow across New England, all the way down to the mid-Atlantic states. There's a very poor visibility on area roads in Western Mass, Connecticut, and saw a uh, really uh, uh, a bad batch of snow working its way into New York City right now. This all slides eastward through the morning, and the good news is it's out of here for the afternoon. I think the evening commute should be a lot uh, quieter weather-wise. Skies will be clearing out and taking you through the nighttime tonight. We're looking at quiet conditions, sunshine tomorrow morning, clear skies tomorrow evening. We might find some extra clouds arriving on Sunday, but it will be a little bit milder. How much snow are we expecting? A coating up to an inch expected, maybe up to two inches in the areas north and west of Providence, right along the immediate south coast where it's a little bit warmer, probably uh, not even a, a coating. Temperatures this afternoon will be topping out the low to mid 30s across the Providence metro area over into Barrington, Riverside, Cranston and Warwick in the low to mid 30s. Mid to maybe even upper 30s along the south coast in the uh, Charlestown to westerly area, northern Rhode Island. A little bit colder in Barville and Foster with snow ending during the early afternoon and then skies clearing out over in southeastern Mass. We're looking at windy conditions. Winds from the southwest 10 to 20 miles an hour could be gusting up to 50 miles an hour at times. 35 in Fall River over in New Bedford, about 35. Here's your live pinpoint Doppler 12 seven day future cast. It gets colder tomorrow behind this weather system. System. Temperatures only topping out about 24 degrees during the afternoon. Game time temperature about 20 degrees with clear skies feeling like the lower teens with the wind chill factor at the game. For Sunday, a little bit warmer. Temperatures will be climbing into the low to mid 30s in the afternoon after starting out in the teens. And then on Monday, another chance of some snow, but I think that will be mixed with some rain. Temperatures about 36 degrees drier Tuesday and Wednesday. You can get the updated future cast by tuning in to Tony Petrarca. He'll be in later today on Eyewitness News Live at 5. Let's get an update on that morning commute with your Jan.